That'll be me in a week's time. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome to What's Up 412. Uh, I have a confession. This isn't the second day of my three days in a row. I will add, I missed the second day, not through lack of motivation, uh, but through, let's just say, I wasn't in a position to leave my house due to some stomach issues. I needed to have access to emergency facilities, basically. Uh, but anyway, beautiful morning, absolutely stunning location, and the perfect day to carry on my new push for cycling, motivation and momentum. I mean, look at this. Not a cloud in the sky. Stunning. I'm definitely still feeling the effects of my first ride from the other day. And I'm more knackered at this stage of the ride than I was the other day. But look at this. This is all the inspiration you need. I'll tell you where I'm feeling most of my discomfort and fatigue. My legs feel okay at the moment, but this has been a lovely gentle roll along this road. But my shoulders are really aching and my neck. Uh, that's the fatigue. The discomfort seems to be very much focused on my derriere. Having not sat in a saddle for a long time, it hasn't appreciated being put back in one or on one so soon after the previous ride. So I need a bit of bedding in, I think. Yo! We turn around here because I know in a few hundred meters that turns into quite a busy road. And what I will do is I will ride back up this road that I've just come down and do the left turn to head towards the woods. No guarantees I'll make it all the way up there because it's a series of really, really uncomfortable climbs. So I might be turning around halfway, but the intention's there. Anyway, drink and rest first. Okay, heading back the way I came. So I will time warp this up to the point where I head towards the woods. Let's go. Yo! That's not the left turn, is it? No, nope, not that one. This is the one. Left turn ahead. Past the llamas. <laughs> Thank you. Definitely going to need it. <laughs> this is savage. All right. That tells me. I'm definitely not gonna make the second climb. I can't breathe. I'd really like to get up into the woods because it's great up there. And I know I got a downhill ride all the way home. But I've already done pretty much the same distance and elevation that I did two days ago. And the worst is yet to come, so I just don't know if it's worth pushing myself at this stage. I'll have a think when we get to the foot of the next climb, see how I'm feeling. There is the foot of the climb. Oh, I really don't know about this. <sighs> You know, I, I think I'm going to try it, but I'm not going to be too proud to get off and walk or even turn around and roll back down again. If we get to the top, we'll have a nice sit down, rest, chat, and then enjoy the roll home. Uh, but anyway, I will try. I know I'm going to regret this. I can't put my right foot in. I regret it already. I can barely move my legs. 
All right, rest number one. Oh, I'm walking. I'm walking mainly because I needed to take my helmet off. My head is boiling. It proved to be almost as hard walking up here, pushing the bike, as it is riding. And now the sting in the tail. Oh, we're up. Oh. Heading down to what used to be the swing of death. But I think the swing has gone. So we're like, oh. I'm not surprised because the branches it used to hang from have seen better days. I have found a very comfortable log to perch myself on for a second. Uh, I just wanted to have a quick chat. I'd like to keep these videos between five and eight minutes because I do know I waffle and some of these videos end up longer than the rides themselves. But I wanted to chat about something that in my previous video I actually asked everybody not to mention and that is my obvious weight gain. Um, and the reason I'm going to chat about it now is because since posting that video I figured maybe it would be beneficial for me to face this head on uh, and address it publicly. Uh, it might be that if there is any comments, albeit hopefully just sort of constructive, uh, it will help me to basically treat this as almost the start of a, a sort of healthy, a health, healthy lifestyle slash weight loss video diary. Um, I have all the excuses under the sun as to why I've gained so much weight, medication being the main one, but I can't really use that so much now because I'm on a steady medication, albeit it's steroid based but at least it shouldn't fluctuate and I should have a bit more control over it. So if I can just control my urges and continue with the bike riding a bit, uh, this could hopefully be the start of just getting back to a, a healthier way of living. I'm going to try and keep this as a regular thing and I haven't weighed myself, so maybe that will be the first thing in the next video. I will weigh myself so we have a starting block. I will expose myself to the world of how much I've actually gained um, and that could be a good starting point to uh, to try and keep this going. It's good for your mental health as well. I think I'm suffering mentally with the the fact that I've put on so much weight and I'm struggling to move in the way that my mind feels like it should be able to, but my body's not letting me. Uh, anyway, I'm going against everything I said about keeping these videos short, so I'll stop there, uh, catch my breath, swig of water, back on the bike for a beautiful, I mean, look, beautiful ride home. I used to ride down this. I don't feel brave enough today. It's too, um, oh, <laughs> rooty. All right, looks like I'm going on the road. I've taken a wrong turn somewhere. So I will be on the road for probably the remainder of this journey. I'm not enjoying this. That big pickup, I don't know, it's just gone out of view. Big pickup truck, going far too fast for the road this skinny, virtually rubbing my shoulders. Oh, hang on a minute, I think I know where I am. And I can cut back across, yes. Change of plan. And if I'm right, this cuts onto the latter part of where I was headed. Yes, it does. I've only, oh, that's, that's good. I've only missed out about, I don't know, half a kilometre. Beautiful. Let's go. Oh my God, this is rough. I think I'm going to be getting off for this final bit of this descent as well. You know, uh, they say steroids shrink your balls. Well, they've definitely shrunk mine. I used to have the balls to ride down this, unless it was very wet. In fact, I crashed on here once. I wouldn't even attempt it now. It's uncomfortable just walking down, holding the brakes on my bike. Yeah, you see, nearly went in my shoes. Oh, it's a nice little straw hat for somebody, some opportunist walking by. Oh, shit. Walking by. There we are, safely back with the cows at the start of that lovely road. I'm going to end the video here in an attempt to stick to that eight minute rule. I think I've probably already gone past it, but with your living hope. Morning.
So as I descend this treacherous gravelly path, I will thank you all very much for watching. Wish you all very happy whatever's left of your weekend. Uh, and I'm not going to promise, but I will try my very best to keep this going. Because I'm lo I am genuinely loving it. And if I get some health benefits out of it, which I surely should do, it's a win-win. So anyway, on that note, thank you all. Catch you on the next one. <coughs> <coughs> I just swallowed up. <coughs> swallowed some kind of insect. <coughs> oh, Jesus.